Being loving and caring is just such a beautiful part of human nature. Everything that we do can be powered by that sense of belonging, that understanding for each other and our differences, and ultimately that's what music is. You know, it's an expression of the human soul. And so that's love to me. If we can express that in a song in te reo Māori, well, that's really special. Nice. And just with that first one, we want to go a strong ka. Ka. So we can hear the ah sound there. Okay, give it a few goes. We've been recording a version of So True by the Black Seeds in Te Reo Māori. The song was released 20 years ago on our album On The Sun, and it's definitely one of our most well-known tracks. Nice. Everyone knows the song in Aotearoa, whether you're Māori, Kiwi, Pākehā, whatever you are. And to be able to translate that into Māori, it's beautiful. We're lucky that people love the song as part of their story of being from Aotearoa. It's always been a song for celebrations of love. People have heard the song and made engagements, walked down the aisle to it. It sits in a place of calm love, summer holidays in Aotearoa, Bahudakawa trees, having fun, you know. It's just a wonderful to even think that we've been part of that sentiment. Now, with the Te Reo Māori translation, we can grow that. When you over-exaggerate, it sounds it really sounds better. nice to me. Yeah. Okay, Cause good. Because the vowels are clearer, yeah. I think it's important to treasure the track and then to treasure and respect Te Reo Māori and to put that together, you know? Over the years of playing the song for such a long time, we almost wanted to stop playing the song because we played it so much. I personally had to learn to, to love it again for what that song does for people. In Māori, it just sounds beautiful, you know? It's a great way to just revitalise the song again. Nice, bro. Yeah, all right. Hey, I've got two notes. <laughs> yes. And it's the start, so it makes sense. Okay. You know, for, okay. You know, That's good. You know, initially, the song was inspired by romantic love. The meaning of the song has grown into that and love for Aotearoa. I think it's great now that the, the meaning of the song is changing into a love for, for everyone. This song has everything. Love, unity, authenticity. Because Te Reo Māori is such a spiritual language, it just enhances that. It's beautiful and an honour to be doing this, you know, to be part of the Wata Anthems Ko Papa and to share the messages of unity and aroha and so true, koe a ko koe. It's cool, man. <laughs>